A Sussex company has developed a pioneering car seat that actually cocoons a baby in a protective shell if it's involved in an accident. It's called the Carcoon, and it uh, also protect, protects against fire and flying debris and could be available in the shops from next year. Its creator, Julian Preston Powers from Brighton, also came up with a motorcycle helmet that cools on impact, acting as an ice pack to reduce swelling to the brain after a crash. Well, Ellie Price has been finding out more about his latest invention. Last year, there were more than 5,600 crashes on the roads of Kent and East Sussex. Nearly 900 people were killed or seriously injured. Even wearing a seatbelt, they're chilling figures for any driver, especially those with young children. Airbag technology has protected adults in automotive crashes for a very long time, uh, but has not afforded children um, any form of protection whatsoever. Even if a young child is strapped into a forward-facing car seat in a crash, it's still at risk of serious injuries, as well as being hit by objects inside the car. In all car accidents, anything inside the car keeps moving at the same speed the car is going pre-impact. So a bottle of water on the rear parcel shelf or an umbrella or something like this can come forward and kill a child, and it, they do. So uh, what we've done is created a device that completely ensconces the child in a, in a fireproof bubble on impact to prevent these objects inside the car from impacting the, car, the child's head or body. The device deploys in less than a tenth of a second of an impact. This is what it looks like in slow motion. The seat is also fitted with a system that alerts the emergency services if the shield has been deployed and automatically gives them the location of where it happened. But at £500, it doesn't come cheap. You already spend about 200 on a basic seat. Um, 150 for the first stage seat, and uh, <coughs> hello. Uh, no, I, I would definitely pay that, pay that money. Quite painful in these times at the moment, so probably not at this stage. We were recently involved, my wife and I, in a crash where we believed that the airbag saved our lives. So I think if I could afford it, I'd invest in one. But they'll have to wait. The seat won't be on the market till next year at the earliest. Uh, that was our reporter, Ellie Price. She's live for us now in Brighton tonight. And um, Ellie, the invention was inspired by the local community there. Yes, that's right. The inventor, Julian Preston Powers, told me the idea actually came from a Sussex firefighter who approached him and asked him to develop a car seat that could be released quickly from a car in the event of a crash. And the idea grew from there. And I've got to say, it's gone global. While we were there, Julian received a number of interview requests from around the world. And as we were leaving, an Australian camera crew arrived. So a small idea that came from the streets here in Sussex that could save lives around the world. Thanks, Ellie.